Good morning. I'm here today for a lesson 10 of the White Earler reading. Today and tomorrow, we're going to be spending time practicing some of the words that we've learned, some of the new words, because there's no sense in learning a new word if you can't put it into your brain and then pull it back out and use it in a new way. That's the whole point of white, of white readers learning new words. It's to expand your vocabulary in both reading and to give you more words in your word bank as you write. It makes you stronger all the way around. So I'm gonna be sharing the presentation with you today and our goal is going to be working on context clues. So that will be the assignment for today and tomorrow is to work on those context clues. And you're gonna be investigating and looking at the words that you want to choose. So I'm gonna go ahead and present this and we're gonna take a look at it. So this is lesson 10 of the white level reading. Our supplies and materials are gonna be your student notebook and a pencil and chapters one through four of Miami Jackson makes the play. And I've included those right here in the presentation. So our, our learning goal for today is that we will practice using context clues, using new vocabulary to learn new vocabulary. Okay, and we're gonna show that we understand the new vocabulary by being able to use the word in a sentence. Here are the words that we have learned so far from chapters one through four. There are 18 words on this list. I've listed the page number that you can find them in the text, but you can also use an online student dictionary, and I've listed the link for that in the comments of the video. So you could use either one, but your job is gonna to be to take 10 of these words and rewrite them in a sentence that shows you know what they mean. You won't be copying their meaning or the sentence out of the book, you'll be making up your own sentence. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm going to show you the pages of the book just so you have them as part of your presentation. Remember, you can pause at any time. There you have it, there are your chapters. Here again is the list of words. You can pause here and choose the 10 words that you'd like to use for your presentation, or I'm sorry, for your assignment. Remember, you're gonna have two days to do this assignment. So this is for Wednesday and Thursday. By Thursday, you need this, these words and the sentences that you wrote uploaded to your portfolio. So here's the 10 words that you can choose from, and here's a recap. Lesson 10, learning activity. You're gonna write the date and the lesson 10 at the top of your notebook paper. Choose any 10 words from that list. You can go online to Google and you can search Learner's Dictionary, but there's also going to be a link to that Learner's Dictionary in the comments below the video. And I want you to put each word in a sentence that shows that you know the meaning of the word. That's it for today. I hope you think this is a pretty easy assignment. I'm giving you two days to do it. I can't wait to see the sentences that you come up with. I'll see you on Friday. Bye-bye.